Hey gents, over the past few years, I've tried nearly all of the premium men's underwear on the internet. That's all of these underwear brands that are popping up that are you're charging about $20 or more for underwear. And you can see my videos where I've talked about Mack Weldon and MeUndies. You can see uh, right now I'm doing a field test on these pouch underwear like My Package, Sheath, Sacks. Actually, if you know any more, I've got these three. If you know any more uh, pouch underwear, let me know because I'm trying to get all those collected. And then I've got things like Carrie Loha, Ex Officio, if you name it, I've tried to have it in my closet. But uh, after all of that, I've said in the past that one of my favorite pairs of underwear is from the Air Knit collection of Mack Weldon. Well, they have just stepped up the game entirely and introduced Air Knit X. That is what this shirt is I'm wearing here. I've got the brief, I've got the boxer brief, I've got the socks, and I only want Air Knit to grace my tush from now on. It is amazing. I'll link to Mack Weldon so you can check them out below, but I've never had a shirt or pair of underwear that is this lightweight, breathable, and comfortable out of all the other things. So there's definitely some merit to the pouch idea within the underwear world where you're separating uh, your skin in order to get a little bit more comfort. But if the fabric itself isn't breathable and moisture wicking, then what's the point of separating it? Because you're still just getting some of the problems you have with regular cotton underwear. The Airnet X platform is built from a polymid, polyester, elastin combination. And I think you really have to try to believe it. Now, Mack Weldon has a pretty cool deal where uh, if you buy the underwear and you don't like it, they'll refund you and you keep the underwear. I think this is the underwear to try that out on if you haven't tried Mack Weldon before. I do like all of Mack Weldon's platforms. They have the regular cotton underwear, the everyday brief, they've got the silver, they've got the air knit, but the air knit X is the only one that I want to continue moving forward with because it is so comfortable and breathable. I've also been trying out the socks and they have the dress style socks, which is a mid calf. They also have uh, a low show, which is the socks that I've been using for running. And these are just as comfortable and breathable as the underwear and t-shirt. This is another piece of clothing that my wife really wishes could be made for women. She loves the fabric. She comes from a very Lululemon centric background. She used to work for them. And so a lot of her stuff is this high performance material, but you can just see how stretchy and lightweight this really is. It's tough to say show how lightweight it is, but really, uh, it's just, it's a great shirt. You know, I think the closest equivalent is something like these Ex Officio briefs, which are a very lightweight fabric. You can actually see through uh, them a little bit, so they're supposed to be really lightweight, but I still find uh, the Airnet X to be that much more breathable and that much more lightweight and comfortable over the Ex Officio. And so I think Mack Weldon's doing some really great stuff. They're iterating on all their products and they keep bringing out new great stuff every, it seems like every month. And uh, between the socks, between the underwear, between the t-shirts, man, this is good. The fabric of the Airnet X compared to the original Airnet platform, I love these ones, like I said, but the Airnet X is so much more uh, just breathable, lightweight, and you can see some of the design flourishes on this one where you've got more of a mesh design near the waistband, and then you've got this, it's, it's all very stretchy. Uh, I can't say enough good things about these. As much as I loved my original Airnet, huge improvement. They've also done a nice update on the waistband here on the Airnet X. So this is the previous Airnet, and this is the waistband that is on almost all of the Mack Weldon underwear today, the everyday stuff, the, the silver, it's all very similar. And it's pretty thick, but this one is much more lightweight, much thinner, and much softer comparatively, and I'm a really big fan. I hope they put this across the rest of the line. The tees and the underwear are extremely lightweight, and so this is going to make it my ideal travel gear, because pound for pound, you're looking to reduce weight, and you're looking to keep your suitcase nice and small, and so these are going to be light, compact, and easy to travel with, and then also just the breathability overall. So looking at this from a basic t-shirt standpoint, if you're looking at just like grabbing a couple of cotton t-shirts, rather have one of these. If you're looking at grabbing some of the more premium underwear, I'd rather have one pair of these. All the premium underwear seems to fall in this like 25-ish dollar uh, price point, and so if you're looking to compare the premium underwears, this is right in line. Look, if you want to try some of the most comfortable underwear I've ever tried, if you want to get a really comfortable t-shirt, the prices are a little bit premium, but I would rather take two pairs of the Airnet X boxers or, or boxer briefs over like a 10 pack of Hanes any day because they are so much more comfortable and I've found that Mack Weldon really lasts a while. So especially if you do a cold wash and either an air or a low tumble dry, the underwear, because you are paying more for them and it's a higher premium quality product, you're getting a longer life out of them. And so I've got Mack Weldon underwear that I've had for three plus years and they're still just as comfortable as some of the stuff I'm getting today. And so I would say if you're hesitant to pick them up, 
go for it because I have never been this comfortable in some of the basics that I've had. Just wanted to gush a little bit about the Airnet X platform. I am really a big fan of it. Please comment below if you do know any other pouch underwear brands. Like I said, Saks, Sheath, and My Package. I'm trying each of those. I've had those for uh, at least a month now, and so I'm trying to give all of them their run. But as of now, I would absolutely pick these over pouch underwear any day. Any questions I can answer, please comment below. You can also reach out at to this core Cavalier on Twitter and Instagram. And until next time, gents, this is the Cavalier. What do you get with a glut of TV? A pain in the neck and an IQ of three. Why don't you try simply reading a book? Or do you just not care to look? You would know, you would know. You get no commercial.